Today, we're going to learn how to solve compound interest problems on the Numworks Graphing Calculator. To begin, enter the Finance application and select Compound Interest. First, we need to select what parameter we'd like to solve for. For this example, let's solve for the future value of an annuity. Now we enter our known values. We'll enter 60 payments with an annual interest rate of 5%, a present value of zero, and make a $200 payment each period. Note that we must indicate the flow of money by using a negative sign. From our perspective, any money that goes away from us is made negative, and money that comes to you is positive. So for this example, negative 200 indicates that we are paying $200 into an account, not receiving it. Finally, we'll leave the payments per year, compounding periods per year as 12, and make payments at the end of each. Pressing confirm gives us a future value of $13,601.22. If we would now like to solve for the present value needed for the same future value with no payment, we can back out and select to solve for the present value. The value of our last problem will stay, and we just need to change the payment to zero. Confirming, we can see that we need to invest $10,598.14. For more tutorials, visit numworks.com.